Hey, Beard here, coming at you with another review. Now, fair viewer, I looked and I looked and I looked and then I looked some more and I looked and I looked. I could not find a cereal milk nicotine vape. I think it's a myth. People have told me they're real. If you have one, I'd love to actually see it and see that it's actually real because I don't believe it. I went to all these different vape shops to look for it. Anyway, I've been rambling for too long. Let's get to the review. But yeah, I wanted to do a cereal milk for you guys, but I absolutely could not find it anywhere. Just nowhere I could find it. But I did find this, giraffe milk from Dragon Monster. Now I'm new to the nicotine vape. This thing's probably fake as shit. This thing was six bucks. Now I had to break it open in the store and blow in the bottom to make sure it worked, but I did not taste it. It's already open. This thing was really packed nicely. Here, I'll pull it on out of here. It was inside this bag here and I had to break it open. 10 out of 10 on packaging. Now what is giraffe milk? First off, really nice device. It's not rechargeable. It is 2,000 puffs, 5% nicotine salt. Let's give it a smell. It smells very berry and like juicy. Yeah, like a very like vibrant, like juicy, like punch in the face. That's what it smells like. Wow, that is a nice juicy berry smell. Let's take a rip of that. Smooth on the inhale. A little bit of burn on the exhale. A little bit of creamy fruitiness. Mmm, that's pretty good, damn good. Kind of like, kind of like a creamy grape sort of thing. That thing is nice. Sorry, my mom just got back with walking the dog, so there might be a little noise ahead of me. But yeah, for six bucks, too. I think I saw on their website there were $12, but there was $20 fucking dollars shipping. Who's going to pay $20 fucking dollars shipping for something? Like, you got to be out of your goddamn mind to think that people would pay that. But I guess people do, so that's why they charge it. I bet it comes from, like, Wuhan or something. That's why. Let's take another rip. That's a nice little nicotine buzz there. Kind of a, I don't know if I'm thinking great because it's purple, but yeah, there's definitely this juicy berryness to it. And a little bit of cooling. It's not mint because my throat's not closing. That is a very intriguing flavor. Yeah, kind of creamy, kind of grapey, very bright and juicy. Damn. I would definitely recommend this to try if you see it. It's a very interesting flavor. Of course, if you don't vape nicotine, don't start. Don't just do it because you saw this review and you want to go try it. No nicotine? Good. There's some non-nicotine ones that I'll check out. And if you don't do nicotine, those are definitely the ones to check out. I don't want to lecture you, but yeah, being addicted to nicotine is no good. But... I hope you enjoy. Let's take another rip. Really cool. It lights up on the bottom. Kind of reminds me of lychee a little bit. Kind of this creamy. Yeah. Huge fan. Later.